Ma, no brains. When you haven't got it, you haven't got it. Cinderella here, she just hasn't got it. <laughs> Cinderella, my face. Cinderella, my long ass. Cinderella, my handkerchief. Cinderella, my ridicule. <laughs> oh, look, the carriage is here. Oh, you all look so beautiful. Yes. She feels a horse. Flowers.
Well, do you want to know what I was wishing before you came here tonight? I'm almost afraid to hear. Do you see that pumpkin out there in the yard? Yes, I nearly stumbled over it in the dark. Well, the moon is shining on it now. I was wishing that that pumpkin would turn into a grand big royal golden carriage that would take me to the ball tonight. And were, were you going to drive it yourself? Oh no, there'd be a coachman and two flunkies on the back seat. And where would they come from? They could be the three baby rats I saw down in the cellar yesterday. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. Paul de Rawl and Fiddly D. Yes, Paul de Rawl and Fiddly D. It's impossible, I guess. Nonsense. You know, it's just the same. I'm wishing it. Impossible. I'm wishing it very hard. If only I had some type of magical help from a guardian angel or something. Or if only my godmother were a fairy godmother. <laughs> Good joke. You're funny. I'm wishing. And the name of every young girl who ever wants to go to a dance and was told she couldn't. I'm wishing that I might go to that dance tonight and by some type of magic or abracadabra, fall your ball and fiddly dee, that all the kind hearts would put their heads together. And all the kind hearts put their heads together. Well, you know what I mean. That all the kind hearts and good souls will put their heads together and wish with me, and that you, Godmother, will help me with every ounce of cleverness and strength you possess. <laughs> Cinderella? Yes, Godmother? It's impossible.